Uh, uh. What's up everybody and welcome to another In Herbie's World and today I'm going to be showing off a small haul that I got at the Nintendo New York store specifically the t-shirt that's Zelda related and also the art cell that's very limited edition. So supposedly they're going to be releasing six different sets and the Zelda one is the first one. And I also got some bonuses. So let's go ahead and unbox the stuff. All right guys, here goes my small haul from the Nintendo New York store. And today we're going to start off with the Kirby buttons. So let's go ahead and look at those up close. These were actually given to me for free because I guess when I came rig originally to the store, they were supposed to give this to me. I told them that I didn't receive these and they gave them to me for free. So these are totally awesome. So as you can see, it's Kirby Planet Robobot and it says, place your Kirby Planet Robobot buttons here. Cause they give it to you separate, like the board and the buttons. They were too lazy to put it on themselves. Bastards. <laughs> So yeah, these buttons are pretty cool. As you can see, there goes like a little Kirby that's like mixing some sort of chemicals. Another Kirby with a firepower and one with the mech thing right here. So let's go ahead and look at that really up close. And that's the closest I can get. <laughs> it looks really awesome though. I really like that mech Kirby. So far I'm playing the game. I think I'm on stage two, I think. And so far I really like the game. I especially like the powers and the mechs that, the mech is only one mech, but it has different powers just like Kirby does. So it's pretty awesome. There it goes, in the back is really nothing. See, nothing. All right, let's go to the next item. All right, and the next item I wanna look at is gonna be the modern day Mario. Oops, let's put this to the side so it doesn't fall. Let's put it right there. Don't fall, please. Right there. <laughs> let's go ahead and look at modern day Mario. Everyone knows what modern day Mario looks like, but I'm gonna unbox them anyways. There you go, it says modern day Mario right there. And it also has the 30th. Super Mario Brothers logo on it, which really looks nice. And there goes Mario himself, Amiibo Nintendo. <laughs> the back, yeah, you already know what the back looks like. Let's just unbox this thing. Yes, I need two hands to unbox this thing. All right, there we go. Toss that over there. Take that out. Take Mario out. Oops, I almost bent his hand back. That would have been awful. Ah, I dropped everything. <laughs> And I really love modern day Mario. He looks super awesome. I especially like the fact that he's 8-bit and he's like more of a, let's say, Minecraft looking character. It looks really cool. But the thing I like the most is definitely the little stand that he's on, the little base. It looks really cool. It says Super Mario Brothers 30th on it. And it's like a pipe. It just looks so cool. There goes the bottom. Really nothing, just like some shiny letters that say Amiibo and numbers and stuff. <laughs> there you go. Let's go ahead and 360 him with one hand. Hopefully I don't drop him. There you go, he looks super awesome. I really like him. And there you go, Super Mario Brothers. Super cool. And now the next thing we're gonna look at is the art cell for The Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess. And I gotta say, this is my favorite thing. I am not gonna take this thing out of the plastic. I was gonna do that, but at the same time I was thinking, why am I gonna take it out of the plastic? Then after that, it'll ruin it. It has a certificate of authenticity in the back. If you can see it, you can read it. It's just totally awesome. And as you can see right there, it says, let's go ahead and see if we can see it, it right there. It says the Legend of Zelda collectible cell art one of six. So there's gonna be five more. Oh, I, I could actually add. <laughs> yeah, it's gonna be five more. Hopefully there's a Super Mario cell. That'd be totally awesome. Hopefully from part three, cause I like part three the most. All right, there you go again. And the cell just looks totally awesome. Let's see if we get up close the details to this one because I really want to see the bottom part right there. There you go. If you can read that, go ahead and read it. It says courage, wisdom, and power. Totally awesome. And as you can see, kind of just like hovers over the plastic. Looks pretty cool. I really like it. It looks really decent. And he looks totally awesome as always. Oh, the cell is totally cool. I'm gonna hang this up somewhere. It looks great. <laughs> I'm going in total awe for this cell art and like I said I just can't wait till the next ones come out and hopefully they come out with a Metroid one that'd be just totally awesome and the final item that I'm gonna be showing off is the t-shirt and as you can tell it's totally up close and it shows Link and it says 1986 when he was first developed and there goes the Legend of Zelda right there just looks totally awesome and it shows something at the bottom as well let me see if I can find it yeah, right there it says NYC. And there's something on the back as well. Shows right there. 
the little logo for the legend of zelda and it says nintendo new york this shirt is totally epic i kind of wish they put something on the sleeve oh wait they got one more thing somewhere where is it right there that little bull thing i don't know i guess that's for people that make the shirt but yeah i gotta say that the t-shirt itself looks totally awesome link looks like he's sleeping and this next upcoming game what is it breath of the wild it looks like he's been sleeping for a really long time 100 years <laughs> that's really strange so yeah this t-shirt totally awesome so there you go guys, a small haul that I got at the Nintendo New York store a couple of days ago. I got the Kirby Planet Robobot buttons that I was supposed to get before, but I finally got them. I got the little modern day Mario Amiibo that I hadn't gotten before, and I finally got. <laughs> and I got the limited edition Legend of Zelda t-shirt with the limited edition art cell. That's like, I think it said, what number was it? I think mine was 122 out of 1,000. So there's only going to be 1,000 prints for that one. And I gotta say, I really like the art cell, and I can't wait to collect the other five. And like I said, I hope there's a Super Mario one and a Metroid one. It'll be pretty cool. So yeah, guys, if you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you guys haven't subscribed to my channel yet, feel free to do so. And as always, guys, thanks for your support, and I'll see you guys later.